Today we are looking at a solution that will allow us to have HDMI output using only a USB Type-C or USB Type-A. And this will be great if you have a laptop like this one right over here, which doesn't have any HDMI output. Of course, it will work with desktops as well, but it will be more common on laptops. It has two HDMI outputs. One will go at 4K 30Hz maximum and the other one at 1080 60Hz maximum. It will work with Windows or Mac OS and of course the performance will depend on the device that we are using. It's really easy to set up, we just need to unbox it. We will find the adapter and also the user guide which it's easy to follow, we just need to install the drivers from Silicon Motion and once we have the drivers installed we can just connect the displays and basically that is it. In this particular case we have a laptop, it has about six or seven years, an i5 CPU dual core and it's working great. As we can see right over here at this moment we are duplicating the both screens and I do not notice that lag. And we will do a test that I will show you a little bit better. Now the resolution that we have on both displays at this moment are the maximum of the display which is 1920 by 1080 at a refresh rate of 30 but we can go up to 60 Hertz at 1080. But if we want we can also increase the extend, actually we can change to extend display which is in my opinion the best way possible to use because we get two screens and at this moment it's at 1080 on the laptop display but if we change to this display we already have 4k right over here and if we go to the advanced settings we have 30 hertz which is the maximum of the 4k so this will be the maximum that we can have or if you are looking for HDMI switcher then we also took a look at it synchronization is perfect no issues whatsoever that I can detect the other curiosity is that we will have not only image pass through but the audio is coming from the USB and going through the HDMI and then it will go to my display and in this particular case I've got a speaker connected to my display but if you have uh, speakers on your own display or on your TV it will work just fine so besides lips being synchronized the only difference that I saw right over here was when YouTube changed the quality to higher which at this moment is playing at 4k and previously was uh, below not because of the device but because of the network